Welcome to .NET Course Gifted with Error Code Solution. In this video section, I'm going to show you how to store HTML tags to database in ASP.NET. For that, first we need to create a database with two fields. One is title and another column is code. I already created the table here. Now let me design for this project. Here, I already designed the content that exactly is look like this for that we need to write the code to insert the data whatever the html tags we enter here the data will be stored into database for that we need to write a code uh, to speed up things here i already written the sql query just simply copy and paste here in button click event save it and run the code let me check as we expect it is working or not you know, I have to give this just a code and hi guys when I click post button the whatever the code the content that will be stored into database here when I refresh the is empty. When I click post button, this normal generally error will get. How to resolve this? Let me sh let me show you. Go to the code uh, web design page source code. In top of the page directory, there you have to paste one validation request here. Make it is false. Save it and come and refresh and give some value hi guys when I click post button code insert is successfully go and check it in database it's storing to database in this way we can store HTML content into database if you like this video please like my video for more updates please subscribe my youtube channel Thanks for watching my video. Welcome, Welcome to Dotnet Codes with Error, with code, error solution. code Solution. In this video section, this video section I'm, show you I'm going to discuss how to start button click event of the page refresh. Before proceeding, first we need to create the database. Uh, first, in this video section, I'm going to show you. Show you. For that, just we open the Visual Studio. Yeah, I already created table name. In called as in name click button and columns of the no last data and format data. will be displayed through this other we need to create the, the design I already designed the form so here I created table and also any first name string. and last name and, and button date and below there is a six dot data there is a label or a place 